Welcome! What up everybody? Amazing Thursday! And I got my huge coffee. I didn't ask for... I don't know if this is... Tough. Yeah, that's a large size. I asked for coffee that he does medium or large and there was like misunderstanding, you know, chaos. I, I don't remember saying I want large, but that's okay. I'm not gonna drink it all anyway, but that's what... That's one of the differences in North America. Nowhere else in the world you will get large coffee of that size. This is like a supply for three days. It would stay warm, but it's not. It's just black, black coffee. Can you see? Black coffee, they don't have like almond milk or anything. I don't know, maybe they do, I didn't ask. So it's Thursday, yeah. <clears throat> what am I up to today? I'm going to Mississauga again. And this is a secret meeting. Having one, two, three. Yeah, mommy and dad, yeah, they have three kids. Seems like that. Dog and Dodge. They have Dodge and Dog. There is something small on the sticker. Some sticker or something small too. So, that's it for now. See you later. I'm gonna enjoy my coffee and wait for the bus. Hopefully it will come soon. And the neighborhood is cold. No, I forgot again. Yeah, my scooter is right next to me. Uh, it's completely different vibe than Toronto like totally different city it's like even though they are so close to each other there's like like there is no way you can confuse those two places like sometimes big me metropolitan area are like intercultural and, and inter look like look like and and here like you, you can you can be mistaken you can say oh I'm in Toronto no you can't say that although I don't know what is the relationship between these two it's more like I think more like between New York and New Jersey uh, th those who live in Toronto think oh Mississauga like like a village like a like weirdo people I don't know if this is the truth but that's how it seems like so far and those who live in Mississauga think about Toronto as like a crowded crazy traffic uh, expensive and the same like so, sort of similar I think I think that's my vibe that I'm getting from from so far being here so yeah this is Mississauga I'm I'm done I'm going back home now and uh, yeah I went good I, I really like this that, that's what I, first I wanted to say I really like this Mississauga thing it's more greeny it's more space it's I think it seems like better place to live for for like family I think yeah that's my observation so far about this places what else what else about Mississauga there is like a huge huge community of Polish people if you don't know for those who don't know I'm Polish I was born in Poland and um, there is like huge huge number of people from Poland and from different nation up I believe too but there is like Mississauga is the kingdom of Poland <laughs> Woo. so yeah there is everything everything you can get like Polish store or Polish kielbasa you can get a Polish kielbasa everywhere almost but yeah, there is there is a very character like specific point about uh, Mississauga, I think. Yeah, so 
that's that's my my take on Missy. Um, I don't know. I really like it here. You can touch trees in in Toronto. I mean, you can. Oh no, it's not that bad. But yeah, I'm waiting for my bus. My scooter is patiently waiting. Okay. So yeah, see you back home. And I don't know. Nothing else gonna happen today. So that's it for today for today yeah I guess that's it and I love summer here it's it's hot it's beautiful and and it's not like this heat this like dead freaking heat like you had in, for, in countries like in town for example yeah but you pay for that when it when it's winter time so this is like no place this is perfect right yeah right yeah we know that all right thank you for watching I think we see each other one more time later in the evening and for now that's it from Missy Saga! See you later, bye! this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't yet um, see you tomorrow tomorrow is a pretty exciting day uh, we're going downtown downtown for the first time since I'm here we're gonna see downtown Toronto so it's pretty exciting although I'm not a big downtown guy I'll tell you about this tomorrow but yeah so see you tomorrow and can't wait to see you there all right take care bye